So Gary, talk to me about, uh, let's say some center com comes to you and says, hey, we want to ship to XYZ country. Um, and that, what, what, where do you guys draw the line as far as, hey, we're not going to mess with that country? Um, or that country is is blacklisted or i mean what, what what's the do not fly where's the do not fly zones um so i would say any practical country that is not embargoed or sanctioned um will be an available destination for techx to ship into um so for example if you came and you said you wanted to deploy hardware to north korea for example you know that would be an example of a no-go country you know as it stands now if you had to ship to Russia, you know, that is a current no-go country, but, you know, that may change in the future, you know, as it has in the past, you know. So generally, we are fully compliant with all trade regulations in, you know, Europe and the US and any other country um, for that matter. So our limitations are going to be dictated by those sort of embargoes and, you know, political limitations, you know. As far as practical um, you know, limitations in countries, we specialize in the most complicated countries in the world. So, you know, no country is going to be too difficult for us to import into. Um, there are some countries that produce practical limitations um, for certain types of hardware or, you know, certain other, you know, you know, aspects like that. But it's very, very uncommon that a client comes to us with a country list and we are unable to you know, service 100% of that list. You know? As long as you're going into free trade countries that are not embargoed, you know, that, that's something that we can support. So there's, there's no real hard limitations there.